Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Google seems to be working on another new feature for Google Chrome. And um, as we can see, uh, it's to do with the picture in picture window, which you can enable uh, in the browser as an example when watching YouTube videos. Now, um, they are thinking of adding a new floating window that will be like picture in picture on top of all the other windows displaying any web page. And they're going to be calling this document picture in picture. Now, what this is going to do, it's basically I'm going to add some more features and functions to uh, the so-called existing picture in picture because currently uh, the existing picture in picture in the browser is very limited in what it can do. You can really just uh, play, pause and stop a video uh, in the little secondary window. Now, at this stage, um, it's hidden behind an experimental flag. And uh, in my region, the flag uh, isn't working as yet. But nonetheless, to enable the experimental flag, as always, we head back to the address bar, enter Chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags, and just enter picture or pip. That's the easiest PR. That's the easiest to bring it up. And as you can see, I have already um, enabled the flag document picture in picture APR. And the description reads, enables APR to open an always on top window with a full HTML document available for Mac, Windows, Linux, and Chrome OS. I've already enabled the flag and as mentioned, currently not working as yet. And that's because uh, it's on origin trials at this stage. So although the flag is available and um, you might not see this new feature. So um, apparently it's going to roll out from Chrome 111, which I think is in the beta channel at this stage. And um, it will be available on Origin Trials up until the end of Chrome 115, which uh, will be rolling out on September the 8th this year, 2023. So still quite a lot of work to do. It's still early days. But just to give you a, um, a kind of a brief overview as to what this is all about, if we just head over to a screenshot that I, I quickly grabbed from um, the actual announcement by Google, this will just give us a little bit more indication as to what this is all about. Now, um, Basically, um, how it's going to capitalize on the existing picture-in-picture -picture window is that with this uh, new full document uh, PIP window, the website can provide custom controls and inputs, as we can see. And uh, um, so as an example, you will have captions, which I actually have posted on previously. You can, you can see your playlists, time scrubber, um, liking and disliking videos straight from the picture-in-picture -picture window. And this is to improve the user's PIP video experience according to that announcement by Google and also it can be used with video conferencing and at this stage when it comes to um, picture in picture uh, the APR for video conferencing is a little bit limited so with this um, full document picture in picture Google says that the website can easily combine multiple video streams into a single pip window without having to rely on canvas hacks and provide custom controls such as sending a message, muting another user, or raising your hand. So you'll actually, uh, in most live streams and video conferencing calls, you'll actually be able to use this as a secondary window, not just for watching, as an example, your YouTube videos. So, and that's the new full document picture, picture that Google is currently testing on an origin trial. And um, if anything does change, and this does become available in my region, and I can actually show you how the feature works um, in real time, I will obviously post and let you know accordingly. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.